Are you thinking of owning your dream homes? EGA Investment is here for you. Secure our quality bungalows with two, three, or four bedrooms. Or our story building, three or four to five bedrooms at very affordable prices with flexible payment plans. At our Sanyang Sea View Estate, where you can enjoy the cool breeze with modern infrastructure such as the roads, covered drainage system, modern electrification with street lights, gated entrance with security posts, and social amenities such as gas station, shopping mall, medical clinic, park, schools, children daycare, and a lot more. Our dedicated team of professionals will keep the estate clean at all times, provide security and patrol team within the estate premises, install latest technologies such as CCTV, Wi-Fi, home network installation, sonar panel, and power backup system. Also, check out for our additional home facilities and interior design service, such as premium tiling, wall plaster, home landscape, fingerprint home lock, and a lot more. Visit our office at Senegambia Kololi Highway and get a free site visit tour or contact us on 4464-838. WhatsApp us on 3259220 or you can visit our Facebook page or Instagram on EJ Investments. EJ Investments, we are first in properties. Remind him that the last time he sent the money, it was not enough to buy all the provisions. Oh, sorry, I forgot to tell him. Are you guys talking about money transfer to buy provisions? Yes. yes. But don't you know about Baluo? 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 What is Baluo? Baluo is a service that your son can use to send provisions directly to you guys from the shop. And you don't have to worry about the exchange rate. Tell me how Baluo works. It's very simple. Just log on to baluo.com and shop or download the app on your phone. You can shop on the website or using the app to buy online basic products for your family and friends. With Baluo, you decide what your money is spent on. Your money, your choice. Buy online products for your family and friends in the Gambia, Senegal, Nigeria or Mali. Baluo, better than sending money. We are very much grateful to summon an urgent press conference here by the King of Rap and King of Gambian Music, who is no other person but Esti, the Gambia's dream, the Gambia's practical reality, the Gambia's way forward, and with him, Gambia music will be raised forever. So based on this fact, we are just going to have um, a quick press conference towards the December 7 event. Like um, we have all put this into our memories that ST has been the first artist to fill up the stadium at the Bacau uh, in 2018. That was historic, but this time we want to do the extra miles. We want to sell 100,000 tickets and beyond. We want people to come, we want people to come with their cats and their animals to the show. And so far, the ticket sold just one day. It is a record selling in this country. People are eager to be part of this event. Everyone wants to be there because those who missed the other opportunity don't want to be told again. So it's December 7. I'm not going to prolong my speech. I'm in the attitude of going always with speed and all that. But today I'll commute myself. Everything will be centered about ST and December 7. So everything is December 7. Everything in this country today and beyond is December 7. So we want everybody to come out. So my main man is here. ST does not need any introduction because he is a milestone in the history of Gambian music. Way forward and salute to him. And this time is going to be Gambiana album launch, 7 December. 8 o'clock, if you are not there, the stadium will be jam-packed. 100% we locally call it. So I will now shift the mic to the main man, and we have so many media houses here. I will just quickly acknowledge their presence. Okay, we have the Fatu network that is going live for us, and we appreciate it. We have Ker Fatu as well. We have Foroya, Gambia Talent TV. We have um, 
Gunjur Jane Koto, we have Block TV, we have Choice FM, we have Sunurem, and all other protocols duly observed. So we thank you so much. And from our high table, we have Ali Wali. We have the main man himself, no need to introduce him. We have Mola, we have Sticky B, and we have Chief as well sitting from the far end. So Mr. Redman, Red Sam, thank you so much for your presence. So I will now shift the mic to the main man and then questions can start to flow. Only about December 7, Gambiana. What would you do? So, so um, first of all, I want to thank everybody for being here. And, you know, um, a big thank you to my team. I mean, all those on the high table. Honestly, December 7 is most anticipated in the country right now. And I myself cannot wait personally. And um, I want to give a shout out to all the uh, platforms that actually came here, you know, to expose this uh, very, you know, a minute. And I want to give uh, great thanks to all the promoters that are actually involved in promoting December 7. You know, it's, an, it's a Gambian event, you know. The name, with the name, it's all clear. Gambiana, Gambians, Gambia, Gambia 100%. So this is our own thing and everybody is a part of it already, you know, whether you know it or not. So I'll let you guys go on with the questions and then you can shoot any any question, anyway. <laughs> yes, my name is Mr. Jaffo from the Project. Uh, Actually, can you talk a little about Gambia? What makes this album special? And how many tracks does it consist? Okay, Gambiana consists of eight songs. And all of the eight tracks are different. We have different genres in it, different vibes, with different information and message, you feel me? And also, Gambiana is different because there is a lot of expression of the Gambian way of life, the typical Gambian story in, in the album as well. Because um, what I do is represent my people in all the ways that I can. So w when I do my music, people will always relate to it. They always feel it. I never go uh, like beyond Gambian level. Like I keep it in the level that people actually could relate to. And um, we have a lot of fusion in it, like local instrumentals always. And this album is a masterpiece because um, of the way um, the information has been delivered on the songs and how they have been created and how they have been expressed. You know, that makes a lot of difference, you know. And Gambiana, Gambiana is just amazing. I, I, I would let you um, hear the songs for yourself and maybe the next time we talk, you'll be giving me more information about what you think over the album, yeah. tell you the truth, like even last year I got offers for free sound systems that I could just basically use and keep the sound money as the profit. But you know like I'm like this is this this is my life. You feel me? So in any way that I feel like there's gonna be anything wrong at any point in time, that, that thing have to be fixed ASAP. Because we, we will be doing this next year, we will be doing it year after that. Who knows when we would actually stop doing this. So you need to give assurances to people that when they come to your show, it's not just them coming to represent you, but also they get a good feedback and you know they are happy about the event and they would even want to come to the next year or any other show because of that. So I think that is one of the most important things. We had to go to um, Gam Music Sound, which I actually believe have the best sound system on stage in Gambia. And it's not, it's not cheap. <laughs> it's not one bit, you know. But then, you know, I mean, extra miles always gives you something extra. And we are not going for anything less. So uh, I'm giving all the fans assurances that the sound system, the stage, it's, 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 it's going to be perfect. Can you please, uh, can you please explore some of the lyrics uh, and why Gambiana instead of any other title? Because I, I learned that uh, some of these Gambiana songs 
Ireland have created a cave in the Gambia and beyond. So can you please explore some of the, um, the relics and also the title Gambia, why Gambia? Yeah. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll break it down with the second verse, yeah? Well, I'm on a pyramid, Egyptiana, Mountain Everest, Napoleon. A Sansu Mansota Arabiana, but Chalute Banajan Gambiana. I'm, I'm trying to create uh, the understanding about, okay, like the pyramids in, Ari like, uh, in Arabiana, the, the, the Mountain Everest in Napoleana. You know, like we don't have a Sans, like we don't actually have fuel in Gambia, but fish is what we got, you know, and it comes in plenty, yeah. Bull be napsering Europeana, Colea de Kiri, La Pandicana, Pacol be brokering Gambiana, Luli the Patican, Semestayana. Like, um, I mean, my lyrics are always broken down already, so it's, it, it, it's hard to break them down. But I'm trying to tell you at the same time, this present condition of the youths in the country. Yeah, Bull be napsering, everybody wants to travel. We all know about the back way, how it affected us as a country. You know, like everybody wants to travel in Europe, you know, because they felt like home is frustrating. You know, everybody is broke at home, but every day everybody is partying. Like, you see people party, like everybody complains about being broke, but you know, each time we go to party, we see each other there. Like, matter of fact, we see people every day partying. So that's kind of like uh, expl explaining the life that, that, that we have or some of the you know, like attitudes that we actually live by, you know. Yeah, so, and um, what was this other question, sorry? So, I said, why I'm Gambiana instead of any other type? Yeah, I'm um, Gambiana, like, originality means a lot to me, you know. I would, I would rather feel a thousand times being original, you know, you feel me? But, you know, like, um, being an artist is about being creative, you feel me? And being creative with me is relating to the people and you know like being the voice of the people you know and i've been representing my, my where i'm from brikama like I've been, it's, it's not like the most beautiful place in gambia yeah but i'm so proud of it that's where i'm from you feel me you know and also like i relate to a lot of things that actually go on in gambia like each and every song that i actually do people have to be able to relate it even if it's a hundred percent you know like entertainment song you still gonna have to relate it i mean the the entertainment is gonna be regarding the way we actually live our lives so it's all about me connecting to the people you know me represent representing where i'm from me being proud of who i am and where i'm from and i think when we when everybody else has that in you then we will start appreciating gambia more yeah Um, honestly, to tell you the truth, like, um, December 1st was amazing, yeah, but, like, um, I, I don't think December 1st is going to be anything close to December 7. Yeah, exactly, you know, like, this show is way, way, way anticipated, like, people, people, my phone is ringing constantly, like, constantly. People started demanding tickets before we actually started selling the tickets, you know. People send me videos, people like, I mean, there's literally no one that I get to talk to about December 7. I mean, when I see people, I'm like, I wanna, I'm gonna tell them about December 7. I mean, the moment we say hi, the next thing they are like, we are at the stadium, we're gonna be there December 7. You know, so they actually giving me the information instead of the other way around, you know. And honestly, you know, Gambians are representing Gambian music. You know, and I'm representing Gambians, you feel me? So, you know, like this so is gonna be amazing. I don't think I don't I don't I, let me not talk much. But I know it's gonna be amazing and it's gonna be off the hook and it's gonna be different from anything that Gambia have ever seen. Yeah. Okay, I see. Okay, um, <laughs> 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 I 
<laughs> Honestly, that is funny, you feel me? Um, I think I think the reason why people love my songs more is because of actually the punch lines and the metaphors. You feel me? It's all about the punch lines and metaphors. Like that's what I do. Like that's what I you pick out any song. But you know, it's hard for some people because if you don't understand a language, you know, like it's hard for you to actually you know, get the songs, you know. Like, um, most of the time when I make my song, I tell my people, look, I don't care what it is. If, if you are Mandinka, or you are not Mandinka, but you, you can hear Mandinka, you're gonna love this song, whether you are my fan or not. But because of the content of the song, you feel me? Like, you know, my songs have very rich contents, and I don't just highlight on stuff. I actually, go deep in it, you feel me? That's the difference between me and a whole lot of artists. Bro, it's not easy to do, mu it's easy to do music and just with an open concept and then you can just talk about anything. It's hard to do music if you have to describe what is going on in here and describe what is going on out there and you know, relate to people directly in a realistic way. You feel me? Imaginary is different, you feel me? Like, like people need to recognize that, but like I said, um, some people don't get what you're saying, and if you don't get, if you if you're not if you don't have a higher level of a of a language, it's hard for you to actually understand what they say. Thank yeah. You. yeah, thank you. Sorry, your question is really. No, for real though, honestly, I mean that's that's the. That's the, okay, that's the worst question I've ever heard, ever, <laughs> since I started my career. This, this is the first time I heard that, and that is the craziest thing I've ever heard. And maybe those guys, those two may have seen that you have point lines, they will understand you have point lines. Because I, for I don't I have point lines, I am point lines. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, so, like, so maybe it, it is funny to you, but it is a It's okay, I understand. understand. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, like, um, that's a very important question, yeah? Um, the thing is, I don't think there is any one artist that is, that, that is said to actually represent, you know, um, his or her country in a way that she has to, or he or she has to speak a thousand languages or almost all the languages. Because even when you speak three languages, there are still other languages that don't get to hear you. So that means you're only representing the three languages that you say. Me representing Gambia is not an originality. It's not just about doing local language music. If you cannot see my music, but you watch the video, the Gambiana video, I mean, the video says it all. You know, when you watch the video, you can feel a sense of originality in it. You feel me? Even if you cannot hear the language. And I kind of blend in all of and a little bit of English, but um, I, st I did a hook in Fula at some point on a song. You know, it was in the YTOTJ album. But um, if I didn't speak Jola, that's because I, I don't know Jola. And, uh, and, and if I didn't do much songs in Wolof, that's because maybe my Wolof is not as strong enough to do songs in it. And I, I wouldn't do anything lame just for the sake of doing it. It has to be professional. But, you know, the language doesn't matter what you actually say and portray. Like when I say Gambia is one, fuller, the Jola, the that's talking about the Jola culture and, you know, like how, how they actually celebrate. I am not Jola. I don't have to say that. But I represent, what I represent is just bigger than my clan, you know, or my tribe, you know. So I represent everybody in it. Yeah, so that's, that's, that's kind of more like it. Yes. Thank you. Probably you are one of the best artists of 
all the threats we face in this uh, situation, and how would you like to stay on top of the chart? What situation precisely? Like competition, like others try to tap you and even overtake you. Uh, yeah, well, um, I mean, I can't really trip, you feel me? Because for me, what I understand is, I've been doing this for over 11 to 12 years now. And since 2013, I was like number one, all the way, all the way, like every other year, you feel me? So this is nothing new to me. When I see other Gambians make it to that level, honestly, trust me, bro, I feel good. I've had this conversation with people. I tell them, look, Gambia does not need a star. We need stars. That's what actually develops the industry. But you know, like one star, like you keep going to every, nah, that's not it, you know. Everybody has to be a star in your own way, doing different things. Maybe somebody else breaks through, that actually paves way for everybody else to break through. But it doesn't have to be one person necessarily. So, you know, if it gets to that point and Gambians are actually embracing Gambian music enough to the point to, you know, like, for, for, to create that uh, situation, I think it's good for Gambian music, you know, and I take it positively, you know, because, you know, like I said, I've been doing this, you know, I've been consistent from most, like, 90% of the artists that I started with right now, you probably are not hearing any songs from them, you know. And each year is like me taking it to the next level from Alliance Franco to uh, uh, um, Penchami Hall to starting it at the, uh, at the Independence, in Independence Stadium. Stadium and other artists actually jumping in to taking it to the next level. Like, that's, that's the dream, bro. That's the dream, you know. Yeah. Um, good evening. I am Aisha Dijal from Gambia Talent Stadium. A lot of people say that you congratulate in Jesus was not from your heart, it was just a game, trying to win the heart of the fans of uh, Jesus. What is your reaction to that? He said, so well, I, I, I didn't... Sorry, we said... No, 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 it's important, it's, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. It's look, December, look, Jizul, yeah, is like a brother to me, you feel me? I mean, Jizul is not a new artist, Jizul have been here six years ago, you know that, right? So, um... Just what I'm trying to say is, I did not even just post it on my Facebook. I also posted it on my Instagram. You feel me? Because I want people to actually, you know, see Gambians when they put in work. It's been ages, bro. We complain they don't support us now. We are supporting us, and supporting has suddenly become a problem now. I mean, what? You cannot even support. Most definitely, we are all one Gambian music boy. If you want, like, if you want it all, you lose it all. You know, you have to appreciate other people, you know, getting what they have, and then you appreciate getting what you have. Man, that's what I believe in. That's what I do in my music. That's what I say to other people, and that's what I live by, you know. So I don't really have to um, say anything about people thinking otherwise. I mean, it's Gambia. People will talk, like, like Jesus said. People nowadays, them go talk, talk. So I just let them talk, talk. But you know, in between us artists, we are cool, and that's what's most important. Uh, okay. Yeah. Another question related to us. How many people are saying some of your lyrics are just locally, and some of your songs cannot be international due to the song, uh, due to your lyrics being in a local language? Uh, likewise for the artists. So what is your response to that? Well, I just, I'm, I'll just respond them by, you know. Um, <laughs> asking them the same question, you know, like, um, Yuzunduri, is, is, he, is he not international? <laughs> what, what does he do? What, what, what language does he sing in? It's because his people actually did not think like the way we actually thinking right now. They actually believed in him and they supported and that took, actually took him a long way. Sakodi raps in their local language. We listen to Sakodi in the club. We don't even know what he says. I mean, the guy is too fast for me to catch up as a rapper like that, you know. But we are all feeling his music. So it's not, music is a vibe, you know. There is this song, um, uh, it's, so, it, it, it's done by a lady, you know. Uh, I forgot, you know, but it goes something like, Langele, Langele, wa, Langele, Langele, wa. Like, I love that song. I listened to it over a thousand times, trust me. I love that song to death. I have no idea what 
vibes, he says. Exactly. It's all vibe, it's all feeling, you know. So that's that's what I believe in, you know. I don't I don't believe in, you know, music have, having to be in a specific language or anything like that. The Arabs, they don't do English music, they do Arab music. The Chinese, they don't do English music, they do Chinese music, bro. Senegal, they do Mbala. They do it in their own language. I mean, who does Mbala with English? Nobody, you know, and they still doing their thing. That's what I believe in, so... You know, I think any music can be break through. Music is a feeling, it's a universal language, and it connects people. Just give good music, good listeners would feel it. Yeah. SD, my name is Matar. What effort are you doing to fill the stadium? I mean, um, honestly, right now, I mean, just I'm, I'm done with the album. I'm just set with the album, actually. But the effort, I would say, you know, these are the people that are doing the efforts. Because they are the ones going to radios, they are the ones busy out there doing hood to hood tours, they are the ones uh, 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 organizing the carnival, they are the ones busy selling the tickets, they are the ones mobilizing people. In fact, they are the ones that actually organize this gathering. You feel me? So I have a strong team behind me and people that are actually willing to work and, you know, like, and with the fans out there, everybody's sharing. I see people sharing every day. Like on my Instagram, I get tagged over 200 times daily. You know, like that. That's fans sharing and taking videos of the songs that are actually released. You know, so I mean, I would just give that to to, to, to the people out there actually behind me supporting me. Yeah, I'm just waiting for December 7 to give my own piece of the cake. Yeah. One last question. And don't laugh. Okay. Um, if, if, it's just a lot of questions to my first question. Okay. Um, is there any difference between punchline and rhyme for the benefit of those who are saying that your music don't have punchline? There is a difference between punchlines and rhyming okay. and metaphors. I mean, all these things are different. You feel me? Like, yeah, it, it, it's a little. It's a little complicated then rhymes are just easy to find, you know. You could yeah, you could just pick out rhymes, that's easy. Point lines has to do are uh, way more stronger. That's what actually makes an artist a good lyricist, basically, you know. And for your information, I'm a Nusrat graduate. <laughs> Because everything I do is original, bro. Like, everything I do is original. Like, from creating a sound, from every ST song that you heard is original. I created the beat 100%. I wrote the lyrics. I, 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 I did the whole actual setup. And then, at the same time, I'm representing my people, and I'm being myself. You feel me? That sense of originality is what I'm actually saying. And blueprint means pop. Blue, like, it means yeah. original. Yeah, uh, yeah, blueprint yeah. Blue blueprint means original. Yeah. Don't you recognize my originality? <laughs> Thank you. My name is Mustafa Jallo, the CEO and the founder of Sticky B Promotion, and I'm also part of the promotional teams of the Gambiana album 2019. Uh, the information that I want to spread out is about the advanced tickets. Tickets are available, like, I will say, Caraba Avenue, Maxises, uh, they're available there. Bursubiton Table, Alibaba is available. Birkama at Salis Restaurant, they're available. And the advanced tickets are $200, at the gate is $300. VIP is $500. That's the information I want to spread out. And also we will be releasing a flyer today before the end of the day uh, where people will also get it to their various places, like the closest areas. Like if you are staying in Abuko, Lamen, you will, we will release a flyer where you can just call a number. The guy will meet you and deliver it to you as well. And also we are having our Rotso Carnival uh, that is taking place uh, this coming Saturday on the on the 30th of November. We starting half past 11 at Abuko Petrol Station, sorry, Tabokoto Petrol Station, 
just when coming from Birkama before the Tabo Court of Ben Johnson. So we are urging all Gambians to come and give support to the Gambiana album. And I'm promising the whole world that this is going to be a different show. This is different from Saluto. This show is like we are tripled the Saluto. So come December 7 and see the real love from Gambian people. Thank you. We'll, we'll have Ali Wali to speak in Mandinka for two minutes and then from there we just give um, a thank you and an acknowledgement to all the people that are present here and then we close it. We don't want to prolong this. So two minutes for Ali. Yeah, Asalaamu Alaikum. Uh, I'm Ali Wali. I'm a part of a managing ST and team union. Mbalbe Kontona, Mbalbe Jai, Lato Na Konto Nyimala, Allah Na Jangal Konto Ngar Jai. Ndal Diamo Ta Jambal, Ndal Diamo Mba Akela, based on arrangement of the program or even though, Mba Arrange La Nyami. Based, Eka Fanyami Nko, Ndal Nimmo Sabanada Wai, Mule Satisfy, Ya Kontan, Komi Nga Kanyami last year, December on the 7th. Na Stadio Kom SDA Fanyami, Stadio Sound System, is 100% competent correct. In fact, Nga Jego Estado Mulke Siali. Dalam sahaja soal ini, nombor bunda sebagai jalan fokus bunda na, mianlah ko murta batala base tonya long ama izinah program ola, ya batala jauh fengeje. Anu banyak ni lama mobil ko mohon ada security hundred percent long, iba skill ala na, in fact ieda file suruh ko hundred percent komputer. Ani seven o'clock, ni mohon mana itu sila sorang, base even though pavilion four belum fal, dalam dua malam ini sandal, kami ala jibinya, kami Morocco ni Gambia la maju dua malam start of adanya ni. Dalbo double lan. Okay, just to transmit to say to summarize. Dilan geram reg dilan standar reg. Mai tu de ali wali. Dilan wan ni reg sun programi. Dapat tela start. Dengan ubi seven bunda. Dapat am skiri tu hundred percent. Pun nyu tela nyu sound system bi GMC la nyu gel. Like nyu nyu we don't mind pun nyu five sound system bi five hundred thousand. Pun nyu satisfied reg with the output. So ticket bi standar deko jai. So ticket bi dekere gamam dapat over over demand bi dapat over two hundred. So you need to get some day. Ask any of them first to suit a sick away. Understand? So the language of the standard. You better come for this one. You am more last year this year. Malunya death. We want to do more than that. That's the only competition we have. Thank you. So the last year, we get there and need yep content. Then we want to get two step ahead of it. Not the same crowd like you saw. Not the same performance like you saw. We want to make it three step ahead. So your competition your regular you am. And like everybody, we want to make with your competition with your own life. Last year, we achieved. Next year, we will achieve more than that. That's what we call a competition. Okay, Dylan Gerem, Dylan Sandra, thank you very much. Yeah, thank you so much. Um, now we'll have we have Cham by, at least for two minutes. Yo, salam to everyone, and thank you for coming through and representing. You know, one of Gambia's finest brands, ST. You know, personally, I've known ST for close to 15 years now, 13 years to be exact. And me personally, I was a rapper, and I've retired. So if we have somebody like ST who's been keeping consistent since them days till now, that means, you know, then there is something out there. Because I was having even this chat earlier. I am personally retired now. I'm tired of the Gambian music scene. But ST keep on his consistency till now, 2019. I think, you know, with all due respect, we need to give it back to him, you know. And as a brand of this country, of the Gambia, you know, the privilege, the privileges have to come with it. Personally, I will say to the people that are going to grace this event on the 7th of December to come with discipline, you know, because it matters. Our image is going to be sold to the world. We don't know. Even the international media houses are going to come. You're going to have the tourists to come over, and you're going to have a lot of people from other countries coming just for this event, you know. So discipline from the fans and the people that are coming to watch the show is important. And also the security, I'm asking the Gambian government to get involved in the security of this event. It matters a lot because you can't even have your citizens come to go to an event with the expectations of getting robbed you know, by, by delinquents or criminals. So we're suggesting to the Gambian government to get involved. ST is a brand for this country. He's selling the image of this country and the music and the culture. So I think it's good for the government also to provide as much security as possible without even asking for a penny. He is a Gambian citizen that is selling the image of this country. So the government should get involved in this show and support and provide as much security as possible without asking for a penny. Thank you very much. See you on December 7th. <coughs> Selling the tickets here, but, and then a big thank you to CK Restaurant for hosting us here today as well. Just crown queen of culture to ask two questions. 
uh, about the event and ST, and then ST will give a thank you to everybody, and then I will close it. Thank you so much. What's the name of the What is it all about, please? Um, so, so it's answer. Yes, yes. Uh, yes, yes. 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 Yes, uh, I am going to go to the house and I am going to go to the house. I am going to go to the house and I am going to go to the house. 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 I am ñun don ataata min tola ala la tilu wara wulo abe ben na wolo fe december 7 wolo min ñunti ko estila album launch in gambiana wolo be ke kan jang hani ñang ko mol yaalo ne membe keeri so wo kana mo kumpa akana mo tu kumpa to december 7 gambiana album launch eight tracks wolo ba ko mbolo ko to jang thank you so very much ala ka bi estime mo leeko ila kuma ko do bo bi di am ka memba ko ko ah i sura kala may ko ma ko ro la ko massa kundala so, estimate among sponsors of the world is the first time that Yeah, actually, I've been a security quote, you know, because. Uh -huh, because no, like, more security quo from 100, you know, yalla, and baby team killing, you know, like, uh, obdi, sono, ying, uh, akadasale, what to do, but be from we were able to communicate, uh, ka security quo regular, you know, like, ning different security brand, from basically, you know, but, uh, last year, wo keta kule, the new problem, or the new ganga, jeleko gambian musical, la soul to, wo kake problem, jamale, the security quo is always a big problem, you know, so, wo lo mula mirror quo, the band. You know, like that. For more last year, you know, so I'm to try to clarify, you know, like what if a new soto is a complete different person. And right now, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, because BB, I'm sorry, 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 i after more be safety la and no fan la after more bunda le la this time so mo 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 wuli tanin tankana nana ni bebe bunda kile nga nyanta dunna ni wal so bunda nani le stadium moto and do me mo min expect kanga sia bata so we gonna open all the all the four gates inshallah i will use this opportunity to question killing in kabe bala la since I am the grand Okay, I'm the coach of Bunda. And then, Ilam Mizu Gopo Nongame, who you're Gambiana, you came in Gibinda, the coach of Bunda, Ilamit Gopo. Munatana, you choose to put coach in your name. Yeah, because maybe in Tamawulu come Yalane, Mawulu come Dinamiyalanko with opportunities, and Yalane was stuff Yalane. I was like any ordinary kid. Yeah, and the Gambia society kona. And don't wuluta wale kona, wuluta wale kona. And don't ng kumasta wale fanam kona. Yeah, and ng jibindal letter. Maybe say it's a jibindal ni ng karaba avenue le tong comfort tong kong hit. Ine ne tajela. We atre million le fanga landi tajela. You know, but you know there was a time jibindal ebe dula bito. Like that, and then give me, give me that free result. I can't see me a file. My friend, you could do it full of tin DJ. But yeah, and come, we're not adults. We're not even going to do it. We're not even going to do it. You know, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. But the parents are going to do it. So in terms of music, you know, I can move. I can do more than this. 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 But yeah, long. I bought a dime. We'll be nyamin nung. We'll be able to be nyamin nung. You know. So, you know, that's how important culture Thank is to me, you know, yeah, in Mbarabaki. And also, um, I want to give special thanks to the promoter of the baby Facebook, Instagram, because Promoter from all Seattle. Don't be a promotion or a Katambi promoter from all Amelia Lanko. Welcome to promotion or a by profession, you know. So um, I want to give special thanks to all these people. Like, 
time in turning energy ka video that I can post to so love yalla and the support we are until get until tell because of it told you know so ila ko until fanang you know nga appreciate le you know ni mo e kala muta ko fanang sa kala muta da you know and i also want to give special thanks to my team you know like mo ni manke mo kelen do ko di mo jama do ko lo so to man do e mo ka mo do la sembun dinga jana la pose den dinga bar a fanam bi jele ina bala ko you know so i want to give special thanks to my family and also um na whole the whole union st and all the supporters of gambian music because this is just bigger than me this is about gambia right now you know so you know saluto and respect out to everybody so special thanks to generally sol minul nata jang you know be minul ya kroxon kandire ngol tire nang ani 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 minul ya ani minul fonge foni kroxon ol fonge tire nang saluto to be December 7 non quality and I want to thank each and every one of you for being here I really appreciate y'all make this a success already ningal ko man dal nate dan ko molla rek wo ka tinna len kam fan kala muta comme ale mul kala muta le you know so saluto respect to everybody gambian bake momo nata jang ñong lena wa jere jef contant nañ ju so sumayata le andum st fanon contanta sain do ko men tuta jeedo rawla ñinti ko be mo be danile ticket o sang on time because wo fanan ka problem o dol sabule but ticket o wa fu dula siata mustik stiki bi a fo nyame al tal yalla ticket o sam birin sai ni na to don dum dam man be pleje because nda nga ma kam mem moy wallahi nda nga ma kam mem moy mo wuli kame ngal no bi na ste de motole so jannim be ta mol be lola nyo ko kan jen tel man tula wala because st mo kaira molti o to al fintina juna al yena nan nga sozo because st ata mu jinna tolete abe sel ste journal de and no artist all men fanay ale be attitude in kal invite you nal bukana baba da toto de baba nala watu sel watu sita aka volo ko momo man play la ha jole biche so al fintina juna artist all ni mol men ale bi na audience to ngal tentu ngal jey contenta gambiana ala man ala ya tena nga ke kairo kono anin yurwa kono st wolung anin 30 million dollars ye bo stede moto ha wala mon na contant ko de be en correct la ni bi na no isi menkeno because sonye gambia le represent in gambian flag yena ni ma city no isi moto ya city to ha wala flag ba you know al benim flag wena teamal wato everybody with gambian flag malla fi flag do la na man ke red white blue white green ha agriculture ni tilo na mala nyoka ala baraka ba ke saluto gambiana thank you investment is here for you. Secure our quality bungalows with two, three or four bedrooms or our story building three or four to five bedrooms at very affordable prices with flexible payment plans at our Sanyang Seaview Estate where you can enjoy the cool breeze with modern infrastructure such as the roads, covered drainage system, modern electrification with street lights, gated entrance with security posts and social amenities such as gas station, shopping mall, medical clinic, park, schools, children daycare, and a lot more. Our dedicated team of professionals will keep the estate clean at all times, provide security and patrol team within the estate premises, install latest technologies such as CCTV, Wi-Fi, home network installation, solar panel, and power backup system. Also, check out for our additional home facilities and interior design service, such as premium tiling, wall plaster, home landscape, fingerprint home lock, and a lot more. Visit our office at Senegambia Kololi Highway and get a free site visit tour or contact us on 4464-838. WhatsApp us on 3259-220. Or you can visit our Facebook page or Instagram on EJ Investments. EJ Investments, we are first in properties. Alright. Honey, did you remind him that the last time he sent the money, it was not enough to buy all the provisions? 
Oh, sorry, I forgot to tell him. Are you guys talking about money transfer to buy provisions? Yes. yes. But don't you know about Baluo? 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 What is Baluo? Baluo is a service that your son can use to send provisions directly to you guys from the shop. And you don't have to worry about the exchange rates. Tell me how Baluo works. It's very simple. Just log on to baluo.com and shop or download the app on your phone. You can shop on the website or using the app to buy online basic products for your family and friends. With Baluo, you decide what your money is spent on. Your money, your choice. Buy online products for your family and friends in the Gambia, Senegal, Nigeria or Mali. Baluo, better than sending money.